In The Mandalorian Chapter 9, titled The Sheriff, did you know that one of the Tusken Raiders was actually a deaf actor? He was actually instrumental in creating the Tuscan sign language. I personally thought that that was pretty cool. Hello ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and welcome back to another riveting episode of Movie Mistakes. And today we're going to show you some of the mistakes that we found in The Mandalorian Chapter 9, The Sheriff. And just as a friendly reminder, remember to hit the like, subscribe, and notification bell now. We'll keep you updated of all of our up and coming videos. One of the coolest things I found about The Mandalorian so far are all the cameos that we're getting in the series. So with that being said, do you know the name of this actor? And what about the TV show that he played in? Stick around to the end of the video to find out who he is and what show he played in. So for mistake number one, we'd like to introduce you to Gore Koresh. He and the Mandalorian are discussing a little business during a battle. Check out the position of his right hand. Notice that it's up around his chest area. But when the camera angle switches, we can now see that his hand is down on his lap where it wasn't there before. So I know what you're going to say. He just put his hand down. But man, he's moving awfully fast for my taste. Staying in the same scene, Gore and his friends get the drop on the Mandalorian. So during the shootout, the Mandalorian gets up, kicks Baby Yoda out of the way as he goes to work. Make a mental note that at this frame here, there's no one behind him. But as the battle continues, the camera angel switches back and forth and suddenly there's a henchman behind him that wasn't there earlier. Maybe he's using the force? I don't know. So for mistake number three, we're going to introduce you to Peli Mato. For all you true Star Wars fans out there, forgive me if I didn't say it right. And if you're thinking to yourself, man, she looks familiar. Here's how she normally looks. And that there's a slight kiss on the lips of the glasses. Wow, well, yeah, he is kissing for sure. That's right. The actress that plays Peli Mato is actually the actress that plays Amy Sedaris in At Home with Amy Sedaris. So as the Mandadorian lands, notice that the robot stops just short of the shadow here. But as the clip continues to roll, notice that the camera angle switches back and forth, and now the shadow is a lot further away from the robot than it was initially. Oh my goodness, it's like magic. So in the Mandalorian mistake number four, Mando and the sheriff meet for the first time. And keep a close eye on this cloth-like material that's sitting on the table in front of the sheriff. The camera angle switches over to the Mandalorian, then back to the sheriff once again, and notice that that cloth-like material that was on the table earlier is now gone. So for this mistake, the Mandalorian and his new friend meet up with some Tusken Raiders. Take note of the position at which the Tusken Raiders are standing. But as they continue their discussion in sign language out in the desert, notice the camera angle switches back and forth and the guy that was standing in front of the Mandalorian vanishes. So just as a side note, the Mandalorian has agreed to help the sheriff get rid of a sand dragon. Looks like more of a worm, but dragon. As the two walk out of the building hand in hand, notice this guy that is close behind them. However, when we get a shot of our two heroes from a different angle, notice that there is one guy ahead of the guy that was in the previous shot, and he comes out after. So for our final mistake, we've got a Tusken Raider out in the open all by himself. He kneels down to touch the ground and notice that his shadow is positioned directly in front of him. Or her, we want to be politically correct. But as the camera angle switches over to Baby Yoda and then back to the Sand Raider, we can see now that the shadow has moved. Man, he must have been kneeling down there for quite a while. So were you able to figure out the name of the actor who played the sheriff in The Mandalorian? No? Well, it's okay. We got you covered. The actor's actual real name is Timothy Oliphant. He plays the role of Deputy Marshal Raylan Givens in the hit TV show Justified. The series only ran for about five years, but I'll tell you this much, it was actually a really great show. If you haven't seen it yet, I highly recommend it. So what did you think of these cool Mandalorian mistakes? Let us know in the comment section below which one was your favorite. Also as usual, remember to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell now. We'll keep you updated of all of our up and coming videos. Thanks for hanging out with us here at Movie Mistakes, and we'll see you next time.